PED is a short form for a disease called porcine epidemic diarrhea virus, and it's a new disease to North America. It's porcine because it only affects pigs, doesn't affect people or cattle or anything else. It causes diarrhea and uh, significant diarrhea, and it spreads very quickly like an epidemic. So it's porcine epidemic diarrhea virus, and it's quite nasty. It's spread through the herd very quickly and kills baby pigs, and everyone else gets sick. It's not a new virus. We dealt with this in the 80s and 90s in Europe. It's active right now in Asia, but it's new to North America. Our pigs have never seen this virus, and so all our pigs in North America are susceptible to this condition. The virus, when they get diarrhea, the virus is present in the manure. So the manure becomes very infectious. Any thing that goes between farms that could carry manure is, is a significant risk to a farm. So trucks that have been to other farms or have driven through manure on other farms, people that haven't changed their boots, uh, any piece of equipment that goes from one farm to the other is potentially a risk. The, in the winter time, the virus survives very, very well in snow and cold, and so if a piece of virus falls off a truck, it can remain active in the snow for quite a while in the yard, and then you accidentally track it in. So to prevent it, be really careful about any contact with other, other pig farms, other farms, or any equipment that's been on another farm. The, the virus, would, what it does on a farm is it causes diarrhea, so usually what you'll see is one or two animals with, with diarrhea. Very quickly then more and more animals will be, will be affected. Where it's particularly clear that it's that virus is in baby pigs, pigs that are less than two weeks of age. They are hit very hard and have a high mortality rate. So if you see small pigs with diarrhea that doesn't respond and is spreading quickly, that's what should catch your attention. Uh, because it's epidemic in nature and can spread very easily, the danger is if your farm is infected, you may inadvertently uh, spread the disease to other farms. The first thing that should happen if you suspect it is call your veterinarian. The veterinarian will know how to take samples, will submit them to get your diagnosis as quickly as possible, and guide you to the next steps. So talk to your local veterinarian as fast as you can.